Hey, it's Shane from GotRom.com. This video is about the most amazing and a little bit unusual glute stretch that you've probably never seen or tried. So to do this stretch, you're going to need two tools. One, a thick green band, and two, a Swiss ball, any color you want. So you're gonna take this band, you're going to sit on your Swiss ball. You're going to hook the band around your sacrum. So you're not gonna hook it around your low back. It's gonna pull you into an arch if you do that. You're gonna hook it around your sacrum. You're going to hook it around one knee, like so. I'm holding the other one in position so that I can get it around my other knee. So now I have it around the front of my knee and around my sacrum. And then I'm going to get close to the wall Put my low back on the Swiss ball. One foot goes up, the other foot goes across. And what this is doing is the band is pulling my femur down into the socket and positioning it in a deeper position on this side and this side. And what the Swiss ball is doing is it's allowing me to sink into all kinds of crazy positions that I normally couldn't get into in a typical pigeon pose or a typical glute stretch. So this combination of the band and the Swiss ball allows me to get a crazy effective glute stretch. And for those of you that have tried every other pigeon pose variation, glute stretch variation, I think you'll find that this hits something different. So when you're in this position, there's two basic things that you can do. You can either have one leg across and have your ankle against your thigh and then sink your hip towards the wall. I always keep this toe cocked up towards the knee. This helps to kind of stabilize the knee and protect it from getting tweaked, which can happen in any kind of pigeon pose glute type stretch. So toes towards knees, sinking the hip towards the wall, breathing and relaxing, or contracting, relaxing, taking a big breath, get tight, 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 hold it. Release, sink deeper into the stretch. Or position number two is to slide this ankle slightly across where now it's kind of on my mid shin here, not out here, but more here. And I'm going to pull this knee more towards my chest and then I sink deeper into the stretch. So this combination of the maneuverability of the ball plus the approximation of the band pulling my hip deeper into the socket makes this one of the best, most unique glute stretches I've ever found. So that is it. If you wanna dismount, it's relatively simple. Unhook one part of the band. Don't lose your balance. Set it aside, sit up. You survived, you made it. Give this exercise a shot. I think you'll really love it. And I will see you in the next video. Oh.